friends welcome to my channel arva misa kuda parva i am prashant tulasi today in this video i am going to give a short overview of all the doubts raised by the subscribers related to the admission for the wlp program offered by bits pilani so if you are having a idea of joining bits pilani then this video is for you so as of date i have created three videos regarding to bits pilani program and please ensure that before watching this video you have a look through it so that all the open points in that will be covered in this and in addition to that whatever queries raised by the subscribers will be covered in this video so i'll give you all in a point wise structure so that you will get a clear idea or what are all the open points present in this topic it will be clarified in a single shot so this topic is about the ugc approval of the bits wlp program so recently a document has been circulated among students so what i'll do is i'll just show you the document how it has reached all the wlp student circle and i receive a lot of queries stating this document that uh, bits pilani wlp program is under risk so is it uh, possible to join or what will be the consequences of the students if this comes into the picture so what i would recommend is here the ugc is focused only on bits wlp program recognition and it has no role when it comes to students knowledge so what i would suggest is the program which you are underground is a very much effective program and it adds weightage to your career so this you have to consider but this is not the much focus which you should lay upon them what i would do is a circle of students who is under my direction so i ask him to raise a query to the bits wlp admission cell so once i receive a reply i'll create a separate video for this and this will get clarified as soon as possible and if you are a student you can raise this query to bits pilani and if you have a reply you can let me know in the comment section when it comes to the odd and even semester pattern so those who have joined in the month of may june they fall under the odd semester pattern and those who have missed that opportunity of joining this wlp program no worries uh, even semester is there which starts in the month of november to january so no worries about that click collecting all the informations and once that is open you can go and apply for that so the pattern remains the same no change in the structure but bits pilani deals in such a way that it has one first semester and second semester so one is considered as odd and second one is considered as even so this will be followed and if you are going to the third semester too then in the bits point of view it will be considered as first semester so no need to worry about that so this is a clear logic which is followed by bits when it comes to odd and even semester pattern this wlp program will give a wide range when it comes to work life balance here the attendance is not considered which is a big plus for the working professionals so if you are a working professional and if you find a tough time in uh, focusing on subjects and all then this course is for you better go and opt for it and if you need any tips and suggestions from my end so you can feel free to ask me i can help you out if you have any doubts please mention in the comments area so i'll give you a reply to that my email id is also mentioned in the description so there i have mentioned a note that please discuss with me before sending an email because i don't want a pile up of emails in my inbox so please ensure that you have a discussion with me before sending me an email clearing the exam clearing the subjects in the wlp program so i received this query from one of the subscriber and uh, i am sure that this is a common one in most of the students mind so clearing the subject so what will happen so if i fail in a subject what will happen so nothing to worry because in my course duration i have never seen a single student who have failed in this course rather getting the lowest pass grade which is nothing but d so what will happen if a student gets d in all the subjects so he will not meet the minimum criteria for getting the degree certificate which is 5.5 cgpa or 55% so this i have seen some students who have been caught at the last point so ensure that you study well and don't focus on getting the least pass grade and failing in a subject not at all possible because i have not seen any students who have failed 
but if the student is not able to appear for the exam then he will be considered as a fail where we have to pay a complete semester fees for a single subject in each semester only four subjects are allowed and if a person fails in one subject too he has to pay a fees for the complete semester so this is how the bispilani has planned the exam structure so no need to worry for that clearing the subject is damn easy so it is not very lenient to pass the subjects so please ensure that the professors whom we are getting taught are phd's so they will expect more outputs from us so clearing the subject is not easy but getting more marks is a tough task next comes the mentor selection so selecting a mentor is a very easy task so don't stress your mind too much so the mentor must be from your organization and he must have a minimum of masters if you are applying for a masters degree and if you are applying for bachelors then a masters degree is sufficient so what about the mentor part will he be contacted by bits or will he be troubled too much because of your studies so this is a doubt which falls in every student's mind so what i would say is in my case my mentor is not at all disturbed from the bits plan he said so only task he used to do is he used to guide me for all the knowledge part and uh, to the least extent he will be used only for the signature purposes so no need to worry of that and you can say to the mentor that you will be disturbed to the least minimum possible when it comes to bits pilani wlp course so the mentor selection part is very clear about the acceptance letter so if you are joining for this course an acceptance letter is a must from your company so there it must be written that uh, they have no objection for you joining this course and if the letter is obtained from your organization you need to give it along with the other documents during admission procedure so the degree certificate so the degree certificate which we obtained at the last is considered as a full time degree so no need to worry that if it falls under wlp or distance because we had a private convocation and that a professor confirmed that this is a same as a full time degree student who stays there and does his course so no need to worry about that so the only point where you will get a question is if you are applying for a job and if they ask that your study period falls on the same as you have the work experience so this is where the problem comes so you can say to them that i did this wlp course and this is how the course is structured so no need to worry of that and if they ask you can declare it otherwise you have you can say it as it's a full time course so no objection for that so this is a very clear direction from bits pilani then comes the placement part so for the wlp students placement is a clear no go because Uh, bits pilani is very clear that there are no placements planned for the wlp students so when it comes to the internal job change or promotions in your current organization so this degree will be very much helpful if you are applying for internal jobs so this worked on my part too so what i would recommend is do this course get a masters degree and if there is a promotion in your company or in your current organization or if you are applying for a new job which is a next level this degree will surely help you out so at that moment you will know the value of this degree and you will be very happy for joining this course switching of companies during the course is it possible yes it is you can switch between companies but ensure that there is no gap between the transition period if it's a couple of weeks then it's fine if it's more than a month then you must state a letter to bits pilani and please ensure that the period is as least as possible so if the possibility of switching companies is okay on bits pilani side what will happen is you must fill up a form to bits pilani as well as a mentor change request form because you are switching from one one organization to the other finally so with this master degree can i apply for a phd so this question has been raised by a couple of students that is it possible can i join a phd course in a government college so to have a clear idea what i have seen is whoever studied in my batch has started their phd and that too with bits pilani 
So, as of now, I don't have a clear idea about that whether it is accepted in a government college, but I am sure the degree obtained doesn't have a letter mentioned in it as WLP. So, it is a full time degree certificate, and those who are applying for a PhD program, they can apply with this WLP degree certificate, which is a master's one, and I am sure that you will get through in that university. So hope this video will be helpful for you and if you are having any plans or any doubts regarding the WLP admission part, please feel free to comment in my video and I will revert back as soon as possible. So if you like this video, please give us a thumbs up and please share with your friends. So thank you, have a great day and we will catch up soon.